Welcome to neutral side action, and we're just about ready for kickoff. Before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. And the fans are on their feet awaiting the start of this game as the players line up for the kick. He's out to the 30. He got hit hard. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Tackled for a loss. It's never good for a back's confidence to get tackled for a loss. But this guy knows that he's got to just keep at it and the holes will start to open up. From their own 40-yard line, it's second down. He's got it with room to run. Brought down to the 47-yard line. I credit the quarterback on that pass. He made a great read and delivered a very nice pass for the first down. yard line. Maybe after a nice run like that, you try to go up in the air for the play-action pass. From the 33-yard line, first down. Four-yard line. Pretty good defense there on the option. They'll stop him for a loss of one. And he's taken down at the 31. Three-yard gain by the running back. Third down, and they need to get it to the 23. And they got it. Well, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. He'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Rams and their coaching staff, Kirk, just happy to have a guy like this in the program. Their offense really clicks when he's playing with. Well, I think it gives them the diversity that they're looking for. I mean, at times they're going to run the football. Other times they're going to try to air it out. And when you have one guy that gets so much attention on the outside, it just seems to open up other aspects of their offensive attack. And they've done a good job as an offensive staff of putting together a good plan. And I'm sure we're going to see it again today. From their own 19-yard line, second down. Gets it out quickly. They'll bring him down at about the 41. That makes it first and ten. We've got a first and ten. Ball on their own 41. Little handoff. Runs it left for a decent game. That's a game of five on the That brings him second and five. They come out in a five wide set. A 
Now we get a new quarterback in there. You have to wonder not only how will he do, but what does this do to the starter's psyche? First down. From the 45-yard line, it's first down. Makes it out to about the 33. That's another first down, Brad. And right now, you can just really feel and sense the rhythm that this offense is in. Their ability to pick up first downs, just pushing this defense further and further down, back deep into their own territory. Pitches, and he's got room. Tackle at about the 19-yard line. And this is the eighth play of the drive. That makes it first and ten. run and he's brought down That's good for four yards. it's second down six yards to go ball on the 15 yard line and they get nice yardage on that run And this is the 10th play of the drive. And down he goes at the 8-yard line. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. seven-yard line. This is the 12th play of this drive. He's in for the touchdown. It shouldn't have surprised these guys to see the run coming at them, but they just couldn't stop it. He makes the PAT. So a 12-play, 82-yard drive, and the result, seven points. So our score, 7-0. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He's out to the 30. He gets out to about the 32-yard line. The Rams are right where they want to be early in this one, part. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. On the ground with the tailback. Good outside run there. Both offenses trying to find their rhythm in that first quarter. Low scoring and close right now. 7-0, Rams. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Pressure got to him, and he put it on the ground. Picks up the loose ball. He tackles him for a loss. From their own 38-yard line. Third down. And he is drilled. The 34-yard line.
looking for the corner. And he was able to pick up some nice yards on the return. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Runs left and quickly taken down. The offensive line needs to do a better job of not only handling the defensive linemen, but getting up to the linebackers. That way the ball carriers will have a little bit more room to get to that second level. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 38-yard line. He gets rid of this one. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Throws right, intercepted. He's taken down at the 46-yard line. Well, he was facing a big pass rush. The ball had no chance of being caught by one of his teammates. That's what pressure will do for any defense. From their own 46-yard line, first down. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard line. That's good for a game of three yards. That'll make it six and seven. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. And he's hit immediately. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. From the 41-yard line, first down. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. inches away from picking up the first down. And a quick throw. And they make the stop at the 17. Pretty good gain right there. You know, the thing that impresses me about this offense is their ability to spread the ball around. They're not afraid to go to their tight ends, their tailbacks, and in this case, their fullback. Nicely designed play. Strike to the receiver, touchdown. And did that play ever develop nicely? Well, it's all about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. You know, if a quarterback has a strong arm, one of his favorite routes is the post. But I thought the quarterback did a really good job here of using his eyes to move the safety to open up that void in the defense and then he made the good throw to the receiver for the touchdown they line up to kick this one away he's out to the 30 tackle at the 36 yard line The offense will take the field, hoping for a better result than their last drive. And we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out. I would be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to fluster this quarterback some more. Fires out to his wide out. Brought down around the 48-yard line. That makes it first and ten. From the 48-yard line. It's first down. Two down, two down. Mike Ford. He's at the 40. Makes it out to about the 30. First down. And he 
just gets rid of it. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. From the 30-yard line, it's second down. Fires out to his receiver, and he's immediately tackled. That's good for a gain of seven yards. That makes it third and three. it to the 14 so they go on the ground and pick up another first down they are stringing together a nice little drive here if they keep this up it'll be hard to keep them out of the end zone caught open field he's tackled around the six yard line so they pick up quite a few yards on that play kirk well that was an excellent route and he did a great job of holding on to the football so it's second down and about two yards to go There's a play fake. Got it, but he's going to lose yards here. And this play is number eight on the drive. Met in the backfield. So it's fourth down. This should be an easy field goal. This to try to put his team up by a field goal. Kicks up, and they tack on three points. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He's out to the 30. Six points and a pretty display of passing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense to take a different approach here? When this quarterback is on, he is on. It already seems like whatever this defense is trying just isn't working. But maybe if they add just a little bit more pressure, then they might be able to force him into a mistake. From their own 31-yard line, second down. So we'll probably get one last heave to the end zone here before halftime. He's going to air it long. The defender had it and then dropped it. Low scoring first half of play, but a close game. The Rams with a three-point lead. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. I love this first half. Two defenses that will flat stick their face in the fan. I mean, there was some hitting going on out there. Good, clean, tough football in the first half. Much like you experienced. David, there was almost a, a magic number for your teams at Georgia. If, if you got to a, a certain number of points, game was over yeah when we when we, I was there for my four years when our team scored over 17 points we, we were undefeated so when you have a great defense first of all you have high expectations you expect to come in and shut the opponent out it and the offense on the other side you know what you got too. you don't have to go out there and try to fling it around the yard and score 30 points a game you don't have to put a lot of pressure on yourself you just execute the plays that are in front of you and realize that punts aren't gonna kill you I got a dominant side of the football Play towards that strength. 
Don't shoot myself on the foot on the other side of the football. David's ready to get back on that couch, get the remote, get all the games dialed up to watch what's going on around the country. Time to get you back for your second half. Brad and Kirk, ready to roll. All right, Reese Davids, thanks, guys. Just about set to start the third quarter. Gets out to about the 31. Both sides have made their way back out, and we're just about set to get going again. on the carry and it's difficult to run on this defense when they put this kid up in the box that makes it second it's second and eight ball on the 33 yard line they'll line up with five wide receivers and a nice catch there before he stepped out of bounds a quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back to pass. There's a strike complete. He's down. They're about four yards away here on second down. He gets to about the 34-yard line. That makes it first and ten. Room around the corner. Nice gain as he works the right side. Gaining four yards. That makes, that makes it second, it second and six. six. From the 30-yard line, second down. Quick throw to the tight end. They bring him down in the backfield. down and they need to get it to the 24. Straight ahead on the give and there's nowhere to run. It's up, and he nails the long field goal. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. They'll bring him down at the 27. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. And he's tackled after positive yardage. So it's second down now. They need about four yards to pick up the first. There was a strike over the middle, and he's taken down at the 37. And off, and he's 
met immediately. It was the defensive lineman that got a hold of him there. You're not going to break many tackles when this guy gets his hands on you. From their own 33-yard line, second down. Catches it, and that's all. They get five yards on the play. You don't have to go deep every play to be successful. They got five yards on the play, and that's always a good game. From their own 38-yard line, it's third down. didn't stop the pass but they stopped him short of the sticks and that's the important thing here allow him to make the catch but make sure you tackle him before he gets to the first down marker he's taken down at the 25 so they're just about set to get the game going again Second down and six. Ball in the 29. And they get nice yardage on that run. Gain of six on the play. That'll bring up third and inches. Double tight, double tight. Four down, four down. Mike four, Mike four. Tackle made the 37 yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 37. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. Out of bounds at the 41-yard line. That makes it second and six. From their own 48 yard line. First down. That's three down and one to go. The Rams in front by six. Great three quarters of action, tight ball game, and now it's the fourth quarter, and this will decide it. At about the 43-yard line. That brings in second. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. They'll spread the field with five wide. And he's tackled at about the 47-yard line. The defense got a great push and blew that play up well behind the line of scrimmage. Here's the eighth play of the series. Setting up the play action. And down he goes at the 31-yard line. From the 31 yard line. First down. The back gets three on the carry. This is the 10th play of this drive. 
Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. He's taken down at the 21. From the 21-yard line, it's first down. They'll bring him down at the 11-yard line. That's a game of 10 on the play. And this is the 12th play of the drive. This is the 13th play of this drive. Just under three to go in regulation. Strike to the receiver, touchdown. He fired it out to his wide receiver, who made the grab and got the score. When this guy's got time to throw, he makes the defense pay. So the kicker's going to stay on the sidelines. These guys will try for a two-point conversion. Everybody bunched up tight defensively. He might not be able to get the pass off. Caught it, and the conversion is good. They line up to kick this one away. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They'll take over here, ready to start a new series. Strike complete. Brought down at the 31. They're about four yards away here on second down. Halfback's got it on a quick throw, and he hits him hard at the 32. down and they're gonna need about three yards to pick up the first down just under two to go in the game got hit and still completed it he's tackled around the 43 yard line Pulls in the pass and steps out. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 42. Flips it, middle to the running back. And he's taken down at the 38-yard line. He made a good read here to find his teammate. That's sound decision-making. Yeah, yeah. 
Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. Screen pass, he's got his half back. He's tackled in the open field. That screen pass nets maybe five yards. He executed the screen play well here by getting the ball to the halfback. They pick up some yards.11th play of the drive. We have less than a minute to go. He's out of bounds around the 24-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. He's under pressure. Wants to throw outside. Zips it to his receiver. Touchdown. A huge pass and catch for the touchdown, and now we're down to a one-score game. And he hits the PAT. It was a 12-play, 76-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. Brett, I thought the key to that drive really had a lot to do with the quarterback and the receivers getting in sync, making it very tough for the defense to slow him down. So the score now, 21-14. And down he goes at the 43-yard line. The whistle hasn't sounded yet. They still have to snap the ball and make sure they don't make any mistakes. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. Takes a knee. The defense calls a timeout, and that was their last timeout. Double tight, guys. Double tight. Three down, three down. Mike, four. If you're an offensive coordinator, you love this play. His quarterback will take a knee. Two times, two times. The Rams, coaching staff, Kirk, do they start wondering, hey, uh, are we going to have trouble with our star player after the struggles he had today? Well, I think the coaching staff's got to be happy that this team was able to win the football game and overcome the fact that their star player didn't have a great game. But I think making adjustments and changing the game plan because their star didn't deliver, I think that would be a big mistake. So that wraps things up for us. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.